definitely aren't taking this seriously. So I'm trying to, you know, when I'm not saying like they, they beat me up, I'm not saying that right. uh, something crazy happened. I'm just saying that I, I know for a fact that they acted against You're how a police Spain. officer You're should be. Yeah. Sometimes. Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, Long Island Order here. Uh, we are back at the Suffolk County Police Headquarters here in Yapank. I'm here following up with the IAB on uh, the incident from March 1st where I was uh, running in the public parking lot over here. And uh, three officers came up to me playing clothes, acting like they were the mob, not the police trying to grab me, acting completely unprofessional. So we're just, I already talked to them once before. I got a video on that. And the March 1st video is why I'm here. But I'm not the type of guy that's gonna just not do anything, not follow back up. I haven't heard from them since my original report. This time I wrote down everything, filled out a statement. So we'll see where we go from here. You waiting to get in, sir? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What's your name, sir? Officer Bernstein. Officer Bernstein. Are you with IAB? No, I'm not. You're not? No. Nope. Do you I'm, have an appointment with someone? I'm here to speak with somebody with IAB regarding a complaint, an incident. I already spoke with somebody. Um, okay. I'm following up on it. Okay. All right. So if, are, are you going to get somebody from IAB, sir? Yes. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> now you can't even wait inside anymore. Huh? Now you can't even wait inside anymore. I was telling the other guy that was out here, you would think a police station would have the door open. You know what I mean? I understand it's COVID times, but it's a police station, right? Let me just get to first and last names, sir, so I'll have to I, I gave it to the lady inside already. I gave to, I, to already? I spoke to her already, yeah. Oh, okay. I think that's who called you. I'm not sure. Exactly. Exactly. This place is open. Yeah. Same store. Yeah. Selling the same stuff. They're not open. Yeah. Exactly. You don't have to make an appointment. You don't have to make an appointment. Exactly, yeah. It's just crazy. It's going to be like that for a little while. Young lady at the desk said someone will be down for you, sir. From Ivy? Thanks. You can't procrastinate with anything because you don't know when they're going to be in existence next week. No, 100%, yeah. You got to do everything. got to get it all done. Exactly. Uh, the gentleman at the door took care of me. Thank you. How you doing, sir? Hey, how are you? Good. Oh, I spoke with you last time? Yep. What was your name again? Lieutenant Musio. I'm sorry? Musio. Musio? Yes. How do you spell it? M U S I A L. Okay. And your name, sir? Lieutenant Connell. Connell, thank yes. you, sir. Um, yeah, I'm here following back up on the incident that I originally spoke to you about. Mm -hmm. um, I still haven't gotten, you know, I haven't gotten received any communications from you or the other lieutenant. Okay. And uh, I wanted to follow up and see what was going on. I wrote a, I wrote a statement because I don't know how many details you got, okay. but this is uh, the complaint form and a okay. statement. I will attach it. Uh, your complaint has been entered. Yeah. I'm trying to figure out who are those, who are the officers that, the other two officers. I know Hanley, and I'm mm -hmm. trying to, who are the other two officers? Because I want to do... Um, requests on their disciplinary records and stuff like that so i need to know who they are okay. so if you guys i don't you guys had the report for like two weeks now so i'm trying to figure out if you guys have identified them yet or 
it's know, been forwarded uh -huh. to, to, who? to my uh, chief. Uh -huh. and then what happens is it will get assigned to an investigator, okay. and then an investigator will reach out to you. Okay. okay. And can, can you give me the number for the chief or somebody I can speak to? You or can if there's call, somebody? You can call the internal affairs complaint number, yeah. and you can ask to speak to. Okay. Is the chief here? Uh, he's not in right now. He's not in right now? Okay. Because, yeah, I just I feel like you guys really aren't taking this seriously. So I'm trying to, you know, when... I'm not saying like they, they beat me up. I'm not saying that right. uh, something crazy happened. I'm just saying that I I know for a fact that they acted right. against your how a police been, officer your should been be. Entered in. Sometimes these things just take some time to uh, get approved. Get the, the, so how do I go about getting their, their officers' names? When uh, the investigator contacts you, uh -huh. he'll give you the officers' names. Can you tell me what contact okay. number he's got for me? It's whatever number you gave me. Okay. That's what I have up there. Okay. Is right. this... Uh, Three seven one four seven four seven. Yeah. Do you have another number that you want to give us too? No, that that's fine. Good? No, okay. that one's fine. I'll answer that one. It's okay. just, um, yeah, I just want to make sure. I just want to follow up and make sure um, this is being looked into. You know what I mean? Because no, I haven't heard anything. Sometimes these things just take some time, but it is being looked into. Okay. Because it's real easy. Because I could just show you the video, and then you could see them. I'm sure you guys might know them. You know what I mean? You work in the same building. They work here. So. Even if I just showed you a video, wouldn't you be able to tell me, hey, that's officer so and so? And that's why wouldn't you be able to do that? Because there's a lot of officers I don't know. Okay. So somebody's definitely going to be calling me. I'll be back. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna. You know what I mean? If you guys don't call me and don't follow up on this, I'm gonna come keep coming back here. No problem. You're free to do that. Like okay. Said, the complaint's been assigned. It's gonna be investigated. Okay. Do you have a complaint number? Right. When you guys file a complaint, they you guys have to assign it a number or whatever. Do you if, have that uh, number? Did you receive a, any kind of correspondence with it? Cor what do you mean, correspondence? Like any kind of letter or anything Mail? like that? No, no I no. haven't received anything, okay. no. So, But right. you guys said you filed it. So if I can get the the, the number, sure. the complaint number, so I can have a record. Yep. You want to wait down here? And then I want to, yeah, right? no problem, no right. problem. And just, uh, that's the statement of what happened. You got it. Just the number? That's your case number. Okay. Do you guys have business cards? I do. Thanks. Yeah. Appreciate you guys, all right? No, uh, I'll, be, I'll be following up. Somebody yep. should reach out to me on phone, though, right? Yep. Okay, Absolutely. thank you. Have a good day. You too. All right, guys. So both lieutenants, again, from the Internal Affairs Bureau here, the Suffolk County Police Headquarters here in Yapank on Long Island. Obviously, you could tell they don't find this uh, too interesting and doesn't look like they're going to be putting their best effort to figure out, but, you know, figure out everything that happened. But, you know, I'm going to follow back up. I'll be back here again. I will let's go those officers you know you, you guys could say whatever you want you know I know a lot of people might disagree but you know the people who are watching this mostly you guys understand what it is that I'm doing here and uh, I know you get it I released my number on my videos it's like a Google voice number so it's not really a big deal but I have a lot of support from a lot of different people from around the country and I just want to give those guys a shout out you know, I appreciate that. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna follow back up here. I got uh, more, um, more audits coming, and uh, we're gonna see exactly how they respond, and hopefully they respect our First Amendment right to film in public. All right, guys. So see you in the next video. We're gonna